You're watching BCTV. We're all about Bradford. You're watching BCTV, Bradford Government Television, a service of Bradford Community Television. This program is brought to you in part through the support of the Town of Brantford. Okay, we'll open up the Board of Finance for the Town of Brantford Special Work Session and Budget Meeting uh, for Monday, March 29th, 2021. And first on the agenda, to consider and if appropriate, approve various transfers and resolutions from the finance director. And we're in receipt of a, a letter from Jim which goes over several recommended transfers to close out some projects and to reallocate unexpended or unneeded funds that then we have considered um, in conjunction with the proposed budget. So these are transfers that, that uh, will impact what we will be recommending uh, at the next agenda item with regards to the budget. I will uh, read, first I'll let Jim go over these, these amounts and then there's two resolutions which will actually essentially increase the budget in order to accommodate recommended expenditures. Jim. Thank you, Joe. So, so essentially, uh, it's, uh, it's many pages, but if I can kind of summarize the uh, process and what we're trying to accomplish here is, as many of us are aware, the town has a number of capital funds and a number of, of projects. And typically at, at this time of year, we've uh, looked at those and we made some, uh, closed some out, we did some transfers. Uh, it's something that, uh, uh, that, that subject is currently something which uh, the RTM is also looking at. Uh, I've had some discussions last week with uh, a member of the Rules and Ordinance Committee about, uh, you know, do we sunset these? Uh, do we come up with a policy? But, you know, that's still in its uh, infancy. But what you have here tonight is really a couple different categories. The first category, <coughs> excuse me, is to close out items to support requests. So th those are dollars that are coming from various funds that are going to get reappropriated. Uh, the other uh, relates to uh, looking at the police department uh, headquarters building and essentially taking uh, a series of, of smaller appropriations that were allocated to the police department. And, and you're familiar with a lot of them, uh, roofs, cell blocks. Also uh, included in that is the Volunteer Service Center. They're all part of what you might call the same campus. And to sort of look at that in a, uh, a more comprehensive fashion so that down the road that might actually be its, its own project. And so there's uh, a new project in the current year also which would then uh, essentially look at the police department and, and come up with a uh, sort, of a sort of a comprehensive approach and that they, they would also uh, allow us if, if we, Siri thinks I'm talking to her for some reason. <laughs> not sure what I said, but anyway. So, so what I was saying is, is so it would be more of a of a comprehensive approach. And once those things are identified, you know, we could do one appropriation and we could bang out a whole uh, list of projects rather than doing it incrementally. Uh, we could do it under the auspices of of a contractor or a construction manager. So the second uh, or third part of the, this whole process is that, well then what do you do with those uh, with those funds and uh, one of the proposals is to uh, use those dollars and reallocate those to the uh, the police pension fund and so it, it's staying consistent within function police department headquarters to the police pension and some of you may be asking well what happens uh, if down the road. Uh, we need that other appropriation, and you know, there's a couple different ways we would actually fund that. If, if history is any guide, is uh, you know you need to pay cash for it, uh, like we did with the uh, Indian Neck Firehouse. Uh, possibly there may be a grant for it, and the reason I just say possibly is because uh, 
you know, regardless of uh, one's political affiliations, I think it's fair to say that uh, big dollars are flowing out of uh, Washington in this current environment, and uh, uh, Congress is still in the midst of developing an infrastructure program. So potentially there could be dollars there. And then uh, another option would be to borrow the funds, uh, which the town has done for these type of projects. Uh, we typically enjoy uh, a good interest rate environment. Uh, and in any environment, uh, we'd always be at the lower end of whatever the market was because of our bond rating. And even if we were to go down the debt road, those costs should be lower than what you would expect the return to be in the pension fund, which is our return on asset assumption is, is 6%. Uh, our funded ratio in the pension fund, uh, we anticipate when the audit comes out, will be about 68%. Uh, these other dollars will push that to 69%, get it, getting us closer to 70, which is where we typically like to be. Uh, but you may recall we've lowered our return on asset assumptions over the last uh, five or six years. So uh, there's a lot to unpack here, but essentially that, those are the major themes uh, that are at play here. And uh, I'll, I'll turn it back to you, Mr. Chair. Thank you, Jim. So as Jim mentioned, there's, a, there's a f quite a few items here, so I'll walk through them. And if we have any questions, we can discuss them. So the first section is to close out support items in the requested budget. So uh, with regards to Fund 720, the Municipal Facilities Fund, we would transfer $8,300 from police lighting upgrades and $5,670 from Brantford Hills Demolition for its subtotal of $13,970. That, those would both be transferred out to the general fund um, for a total of 13970 So essentially, they'll come in as revenue correction, yes. In fund 700, which is the capital fund, there's several um, transfers totaling $173,513, and that includes the police front walkway for 8314 UST compliance, uh, remind me what that is again. Uh, underground storage. Okay, the yeah, underground storage tanks. Two of those for 50,000 each. Uh, consulting is 8250. Adult daycare architectural services for 500. Uh, um, Brantford Early Learning Center. Brand, yeah, I'm sorry, yes, BELC, the Brantford Early Learning Center. Boiler replacement of 5837. Town Hall counter replacement of $112. Uh, Willoughby Wallace Memorial Lake, Library walkway repairs for $490. A regional energy task force for $10. A uh, counseling center water mitigation for $50,000. That totals $173,513. Uh, that as well would go to the general fund. Right. The next is the Fund 730, which is Infrastructure Enhancement Fund. Stony Creek dredging, we've moved $422 out of there and put it into the general fund. Uh, and then within the general fund, what we would do um, is to transfer from contingency 32895 into communications for that phone uh, VOIP, and that's for uh, police? Uh, that, that's, Who's that that's for? Town -wide. That's townwide. That's townwide. 8895, 8895, and technology ac acquisitions, primarily police department tough tablets for 24,000 for that 32,895. So now we're starting to, in this case, those are the uh, recommended expenditures. Um, you would also show the money coming into the general fund at 173,000, the 13,970, and the 422 for 197. Um, I'm sorry, for 187,905. That uh, now would be, we would recommend that that get retransferred, re repurposed, uh, let's say, 
transfer out to the capital fund for Board of Ed cafeteria for 120,000, and that's the servery that uh, was requested in this current in this in the 2021 and the 21-22 budget. Um, we would also recommend 40,300 be moved out to the open space capital fund, and that would fund the uh, improvements and. Uh, barriers that the open space was requesting. We would also recommend 6,500 for uh, to move get moved out to the capital fund, which would pay for police department veneer, EFIS repairs. And uh, again, we would recommend the 21,105, which would be for the phone VOIP out of the communications. So that totals 187,905. So there's a lot of moving parts, but basically, as Jim pointed out, we're cleaning up old and either unused or unneeded money to repurpose it for some requests that need to be done. Many of them are in the budget that we just had the public hearing on that we will deal with on the next agenda item. So with that, there's a resolution that would essentially increase the budget in order to um, absorb the, the revenues and the transfers in that I referred to and also to authorize the expenditures. So I'll read that, that resolution. Resolve that the Board of Finance recommend to the RTM an appropriation from increased estimated revenues resulting from the closeout of capital balances in the amount of 187905 This transfer will increase the fiscal year 2021 general fund budget from 118 million 242,243 to 118 million 148 dollars. I'll move that. I'll second it. Moved and seconded. Is there discussion? Questions? All in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. So next we will look at the capital fund and. Um, this is now on the capital side. There's a transfer in of 166,800, and on the expenditure side within the capital fund, you have the 120,000 for the cafeteria improvements, the 40,300 for the open space repairs and improvements, and the 6,500 for the police department veneer repairs of 166,000. We would also. Um, move within the capital fund a transfer from the police department roof re replacement of 75,000 and repurpose that to needs assessment police headquarters 75,000. There's also recommendations to, as Jim pointed out, to reduce current liabilities and uh, those would that's a total of $437,582. And those are primarily police, ex with the exception of the first item, uh, which is on the police campus there, is for generator replacement volunteer services of 43,000. Again, these are gonna be repurposed for now. We're moving them out of the capital fund into the general fund. So the generator replacement, 43,000. The police department generator for $17,025, $17,025. The other allocation for the generator of 13,000. A allocation of 75,000 for the roof. Cell block of 31,807. The roof of 75,000 and another roof allocation of 50,000 and police cell block allocation of 32,750. And the reason why these are all separate is because uh, it, when others are looking at the codes here, some were appropriated in various years beginning in 2017. So you have items coming out of the 2017 year, the 18 year, the 19 year, the 20 year, and the 21 year. That's why there's a lot of overlap with regards to the titles and the labels. Next is, police roof replacement allocation of 50,000, and that happened to be in the 20, 2020 year. And then there's a police garage roof replacement of 50,000 that was allocated in the fiscal 21 year. That totals 437,582. That would be transferred to the general fund. 
and from there we would recommend that the transfer um, into the fund 700 of 437,582 and we would increase I'm sorry, that would come into the general fund of yeah, 437582 as revenue, essentially. And it would be allocated to the expenditure of, I think the, uh, the label's wrong on this, um, of police pension contribution 437582. So that's what Jim had explained, that that, would, that 437000 come into the general fund, go out to the police pension fund to reduce the long-term long liability and our unfunded li liability. So with all of those movements, there's another resolution required, again, to raise both sides of the budget, essentially. Resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation from increased estimated revenues resulting from the closeout of capital balances in the amount of 437582 This transfer will increase the fiscal year 2021 general fund budget from 118431148 to $118,867,730 and will be used to fund the police fund the police pension requirements. I'll move it, Joe. Moved I'll by second Robert. It. I'll second it, Joe. Seconded by Jeff. Thank you. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Okay, thank you. That takes care of the item number one, and we'll move on to the next item, which is the 20... 2021-2022 budget workshops work session and this is where we will review the budget that was presented to us over the last week the several days last week with public hearings and then subsequent review and discussions and we will recommend a budget to the RTM tonight before I get before I move into that, um, just for a recap, that we had we had a budget proposals before us of 121 million 552,768 for a total increase re requested of 3 million 310,525. There was uh, a net to be raised from taxation of 103 million 993,491. And we had an estimated grand list of three billion six hundred ninety-three thousand, and that would have equated to a mill rate of twenty-nine point eighty-three. So that's what we had reviewed during the process, and tonight we will vote on each budget item, each either budget item or department, and and then recommend a budget in total to the representative town meeting. As in prior years, we'll start with the Board of Ed. And what, I, what I'm gonna do tonight, instead of flipping through the book and every page, I'm gonna use the summary page. Um, so for those in the audience, there's, uh, it would be, I'd be looking at the pages uh, three through five in summary. And um, we'll start with the Board of Ed, which for us is on page five. And what we're recommending, they had a, a request of $60,287,694. And we're recommending a budget of 60,000, I'm sorry, $60,005,541, a reduction of 282,000, 153 from the request, which would represent a 2% increase, and that reduction is to accommodate a reduced estimated requirement for health insurance to the 97% of claims. 
So is there discussion or somebody like him to move that? I'll move it, Joe. I'll second it. Been moved and second. Is there discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you. And we will also go to the Board of Ed Capital. which they had a request of $418,000 and we are recommending $298,000 reduction of 120 and that 120 would represent the servery request that we have recommended to the RTM in the previous discussion so that we we support that initiative we're just changing the way it's funded and suggesting that they could do that sooner than later i'll move that joe then move that by robert second seconded by harry thank you is there discussion yeah. all in favor all right. All right. okay so next i will go to back to page three and start walking through the town departments. And legislative, the request was for $18,294. We're recommending that budget. I'll move it. Been moved by Victor. Second. Second by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is executive. Request for this for 270,946, no change. Moving. Second. Seconded by, by Bob. Mo motion by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is finance. Request is for 92,942, no recommended changes. I'll move it. Second. Moved and second. Alisa, you, Alisa, you, you okay with who th these folks are? Uh, motion's been made and seconded. Uh, all in favor? Aye. Aye. Next, next is fiscal services, 482,339. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Been moved by Harry. Second. Seconded by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is assessor, request is 460,319. No recommended changes. Move it. Moved by Victor. Second. Seconded by Bob. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is board of tax review. Request is 19,590. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Second. Moved and seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is Tax collector request is 562.506. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Jeff. Second. Seconded by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is town clerk. Request is 273,266. No, no recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. Second. Seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is legal services, 450,000. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Then moved by Victor. Second. Second by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is labor relations. Request is 62,500. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Second. Then moved and seconded by Harry. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is probate court, 14,459. No recommended changes. I'll move that. Moved by Victor. Second. Second by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is elections, $181,084. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. Second. Second by Charlie. <laughs> We got to get you in there, Charlie. Yeah. Uh, discussion. All in favor? Aye. Planning and zoning: three hundred fifty-one thousand five seventy-six. No recommended changes. I'm moving. 
Second. Moved by Harry, seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is ZBA, Zoning, Zoning Board of Appeals, 9,149. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. Second. Seconded by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Economic development, 47,455. No recommended changes. I move it. Moved by Charlie. Second by Jeff. Second by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Next is inland wetlands, 138,397. No recommended changes. I move it. Moved by Victor. Second. Seconded by Bob. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is municipal government buildings, 1,028,784. No recommended changes. I move it. Moved by Harry. Second. Seconded by Robert. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Next is cable TV. The request is 13,100. We're recommending 15,100, an increase of $2,000. I'll move it. Moved by Victor. Second. Second by Bob. Hey, Jeff. Discussion? And Jeff, yeah. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Uh, IT investment technology, <coughs> excuse me, 919,320 request, recommending 600, I'm mean, sorry, 865,320, reduction of 54,000. Again, we're accommodating uh, these requests in the previous recommended transfer to get work done sooner. I'll move that. Moved, Victor. Second. Second by Harry, thank you. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is human resources. Request at 336,282. Recommending 328,282, reduction of $8,000. We did reduce the wellness request um, and did not fund that. I'll move it. Been moved I'll by Bob, seconded by Charlie, is there discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Thank you. Okay, next we'll go to page four, police services. Request is 7,191,885, no recommended changes. No more, a second. The motion has been made and seconded by Charlie. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Next is special detail. The wash account, 525,000. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Harry. Second. Seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is Department of Emergency Management. Request was 25,600. No recommended changes. I'll move, move it. it. Moved by Jeff. Second. Second by Bob. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is fire protection. <coughs> Request is 6,896,741. No recommended changes. I'll move that. Been moved by Victor, seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is building inspection enforcement. Request is 199,640. No recommended changes. I'll move it, Joe. Moved Second. By Jeff, seconded by Bob. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay. Next is other protection, animal control. Request is $192,084. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Harry. Second. Second by, Jeff, uh, by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Next is Public Works, 2,505,356 was the request, no recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. Second. Seconded by Charlie. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is Water Pollution Control, transfer outs, 600,000, no recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Jeff. Second. Seconded by Victor. Discussion? 
All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is solid waste management and recycling. Request is three million five hundred nine seven eighty three. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Harry. Second. Seconded by Bob. Is there a discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is engineering. Request is four hundred fifty nine thousand five twenty nine. No recommended changes. I move it. Second. Seconded by Victor. Motion was made by Bob. Discussion. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is human services. Request is for a million sixty eight thousand two fourteen. No no recommended changes. I move it. Moved by Jeff. Second. Second by Victor. Discussion. All in favor? Aye. Next is Commission on Elderly, Commission for Elderly. Request is 446,432. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Harry. Second. Seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is East Shore Health. 339,861. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Second. Moved by Bob. Seconded by Victor. Thank you. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is Recreation Department. Request is a million two thirty five one nineteen. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Second. Moved and seconded by Charlie. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Next is docks and recreational facilities. Request is 20,316. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Harry. Second. Seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Next is public celebration, 35,219. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Victor. Second. Seconded by Jeff. Is there a discussion? All in favor? Aye. Chairman Looney? Yes. Can we go back to Parks and Open Space. Parks and Open Space. You skipped over that. We skipped that one. I was just, just checking. Okay. Um, thank you. I usually skip one. <laughs> Okay, Parks and thanks, Lisa. Parks and Open Space request is twenty six thousand eight hundred. No recommended changes. I'll move. Moved by Harry. Seconded by Victor. Discussion. All in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. Uh, we did Conservation Commission, yes? No. No, we did not. Okay. Next is Conservation Commission. Uh, 11, request is 11,693. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Victor. Second. Second by Bob. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Did we do a public celebration? Uh, yes. yes. Yeah, we did. Okay. 35,219, yep. Okay, Blackstone Library request is for a million a million five ninety eight three thirty five dollars. No recommended changes. I'll move. I'll second. Moved by Victor, seconded by Jeff. Discussion. All in favor? Aye. Next is Willoughby Wallace Library. The request is two hundred fifty thousand two forty one. No recommended changes. I'll move. Second. Motion been moved and. Made and seconded. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you. Next page five. We have debt service. Principal of 6940000 No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. Second. Seconded by Victor. After discussion, all in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is interest. Request is two million six fifty three eight seventy nine. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. Second. Seconded by Harry. Discussion. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is pensions and contributions. Request is five million eight hundred eighty thousand three twenty nine. No recommended changes. I'll move that. Moved by Victor. Second. Seconded by Harry. Discussion. 
All in favor? Aye. Okay. Next is employee group insurance. Rec uh, request is six million five hundred sixty-nine thousand one ninety. Recommended budget is would be six million four hundred thirteen thousand one ninety. Reduction of one hundred fifty-six thousand from the request. Again, representing ninety-seven percent of claims, as similar to what we uh, reduced on the board of ed side. I'll move it, Chip. I'll second. Moved by Bob, seconded by Victor. Is there discussion? All, all in favor? Aye. 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 Thank you. Next is municipal insurance. Request is for 2323902 No recommended changes. I'll move it. Moved by Victor. Second. Seconded by Harry. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you. Next is contingency. Request is 924,261. No recommended changes. I'll move it. Second. Moved by Jeff, seconded by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Okay. Um, we will now, those take care, that takes care of the town departments. We will move to the capital projects and what I'll do with the capital projects is um, run through them. I think it's individually just so that we have a, a little more Transparency on the, on the on the projects here. So, is that is you page 68 that's been revised? I think. Um, so, we'll start with the revaluation. Request was for 75,000, and we would recommend 60,000. That. You want to move that? Um, Second. Seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Okay, the senior center, you know, we've ordinarily, uh, do I vote on each one of these? I don't think we usually vote on every single one of these. Yeah, yeah, that's what I usually do. So what we'll do is we'll run through this. The subtotal here is total equipment and services. So we'll run to that number, okay? And then we'll do the, we'll, we'll run in the building. We'll go through the categories and that way we have a resolution that'll accommodate, I think that's more efficient. So I'll run down the fact that, um, so we'll hold that motion for the 60,000, but the, the recommended number on the revaluation is 60,000 versus the requested 75,000. We would fund, and if there's a difference, I will note it. If not, then it's what the request was. So there's the Senior Center Vehicle Replacement Fund of 35,000 we would fund. The fire, uh, fire sinking fund request was 350. We would fund 325,000. The ambulance fund with the request was 125,000. We would fund 115,000. We would fund 60,000 for the radio upgrade sinking fund. We would fund 85,000 for the uh, SCBA gear replacement sinking fund. Cardiac monitor, we'd fund at 28,000. Police cruisers, we'd fund at 180,000. And the related equipment, 105,000. The radar and detection and warning device, we'd fund at 12,000. The license place reader, we'd fund at $14,025. Portable radio replacement, we'd fund at 9,132. Ballistic vest replacement fund, we'd contribute 8,200. Downtown center maintenance for 25,000. The DPW sinking fund request was 225,000. We would allocate 200,000. Police department exterior veneer repairs for 6,000 we would not fund because we've addressed that in another way. 
Uh, we would fund that with other, and that's listed in the capital item um, under other financing. And the police department request for power washing of 17,000, we would not fund. We would also not accommodate the, I'm sorry, that was GGB, but it was for the police department, the, the power washing. Uh, vehicle replacement, GGB, we would not fund. The pump station generators, which comes is not taxation, but we would uh, approve that 50,000. We would also, the sewer, sewer reserve fund, we would approve the 20, 225,000. Likewise, the apparatus fund for the water uh, treatment plant for 75,000. Rosebook stone culvert inspections, we would fund at 60, at 50,000, the request from engineering. Vehicle replacement for recreation, we would fund at 30,000. We would recommend funding the plow and sander for recreation as well to go along with that truck. And we would recommend 35,000 for the Blackstone Library Sinking Fund. So the request there was for 1,847,357. The recommended amount was uh, 1,747,857. I'll move those transcripts. Motion's been made by Victor, seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay, and next is for building. One category here, um, this would be a request for future energy savings projects of 25,000, recommending that be allocated. I'll move it. Been moved by Victor. Second. Seconded by Charlie. Discussion, all in favor? Aye. Next is the facilities, capital requests. We would have recreation request for the park tree removal and pruning of $20,000. We would also recommend the foot park, foot park playground renovation of 60,000 for a total of 95,000. Somebody want to move down? No, you missed the foot park tennis. Oh, I'm sorry. Put a circle on it. Foot park tennis is included there as, as with 15,000. Thanks, Jeff. So that total is 95,000. I'll move it, Jeff. Moved by Bob. Second. Seconded by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Next is infrastructure capital items. Water treatment plant, 50,000. Coming out of other, uh, coming out of their, their, their funds. Uh, manhole repair of 50,000. Parks and open space repairs of 40,300 have come out of other means, other financing. Local traffic study for projects, ten, the request was for 25,000. We would recommend 10,000. Again, a general fund, uh, cap, uh, a general fund for that. Uh, road improvement and resurfacing request was 450,000. We would fund those, that amount. Sidewalk replacement, 65,000. And seawall repair of 35,000. So the request was for 715,300. Recommended funding of 700,300. What's that? Did somebody move that? I did, Jeff. Jeff, somebody second it? Second. Second it, thanks, Harry. You, you had a question, Victor? Yeah, it's, it's, it's total, it's just. That you don't, you don't like the total? <laughs> My total disagrees. Uh, you got an issue with that that line item there, Jim? What was the question? The 700,300, Victor's questioning it. But the, the, the new total is what, Joe? 700,300. Yeah. The 15,000 is out from the uh, traffic. Okay, my sheet has something else. Okay, that's fine. Um, are you looking at tonight's sheet? Apparently not. <laughs> okay, that's right. Okay, I've, I've done that before, so. Um, okay, so.
Motion's been made and seconded. We had some discussion. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay, so just for um, clarity here, the total of municipal capital items is that we would recommend is two million five hundred sixty-eight thousand one fifty-seven. Why don't we have a motion? Um, I'll move it. I moved a motion for that and seconded by Bob. Discussion. All in favor? Aye. 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 Okay, so that's all of the budgets that we have to review and vote on at this point. Um, if in fact, based on that, I'll find my notes here. The changes that we've recommended and the changes to the capital items as well as the operating side. The requested expenditures of 121 million five hundred fifty two thousand seven sixty eight has been reduced by seven hundred seventy nine thousand four fifty three, which would re leave revised expenditures of 120 million seven hundred seventy three thousand three fifteen non tax revenue of seventeen million five hundred fifty nine thousand but like what I'd like to point out is that we're um, I don't think I have that detail in front of you you, you want me to address that sure, sure. thank you so the uh, the uh, non-tax non revenue uh, is essentially uh, the use of, of fund balance. And you may recall in the uh, current year, we started out the year with a fund balance uh, use of 6,910,736. Nine, that was primarily driven by the 95% uh, collection rate. Uh, the amended use of fund balance is 225,000 higher than that. That reflects the uh, WARF project. So this is sort of resetting that. So if you subtract the six, nine, ten, seven, thirty-six, uh, then you go back to uh, what you used as fund balance uh, last March. Uh, you're using three million seven twenty seven thirty-six. Uh, that's uh, about a uh, eight hundred and ninety-five thousand dollar increase from what we typically appropriate. And the reason that uh, the board did that was they uh, wanted to be cognizant of the, uh, the COVID crisis and, and using more of the town surplus than they normally would. Uh, and then there's another 112,000 uh, on top of that. And that is really to address two areas of the budget that had uh, large increases. Uh, so Blackstone Library was about 154,000, uh, and in round numbers, East Shore Health District was 70,000. And so by uh, sort of splitting that, the 112,000 splits those increases. In effect, what you're saying is that the uh, we're only taxing for half of that. So that is a way of phasing those items in, but you're phasing it in on the revenue side as opposed to uh, the expenditure side. And I think on that there was a recognition that uh, while the uh, health district was not an easy pill to swallow, and I'm not making a pun there, but uh, that in fact uh, we are in a district with two other towns and we sort of all have to row our oars at the same time. So for example, if we were to approve something less than that, that would set up a series of events with the other towns. Uh, our discussions with the other communities are that, uh, that they, they are funding the increase, although uh, you know it's not ideal for them, but, but they are in fact doing that. Uh, with the library, uh, we spent uh, months before this board talking about what our goals were as it related to the library. Uh, I think those goals were echoed uh, with the approval of the sinking fund and using dollars for capital as opposed to offsetting an operating increase. The other uh, goal there was to uh, 
moderate the use of endowment funds. And I think there was a recognition on behalf of the board that this was, in fact, a reset year. And so uh, this actually is, uh, is how you're addressing that. Uh, the other uh, change of note, uh, one might ask is, well, if, uh, if we're not using the 6 million, 9, 10, 736 with the 95% collection rate, uh, that, that relates to using 98.1% uh, uh, as a collection rate. Uh, in fiscal 2020, the collection rate was 98.14. So uh, there is a little bit of a, uh, of a, of a margin there, uh, not much, but uh, what we're hoping is that uh, you know, we could at least meet our budgeted collection rate. We don't know the impact of the uh, stimulus spending. Uh, like many of these projections, you could find folks in various camps on this. Uh, I did uh, share with you an article from Standard & Poor's who basically said that the uh, you know, the stimulus uh, is being viewed as, a, as positive uh, in all sectors. Uh, the reason why I think Standard & Poor's is a significant source of information is because uh, unlike other sources of information, we actually appear before Standard & Poor's uh, either through our rating or through their surveillance throughout the year. So uh, essentially when you shake all of that out, uh, that, that, that relates to uh, a reduction in um, non-tax revenues, but your allowance for uncollected taxes uh, is also going down, and your use of fund balance is also going down. So, so a lot of little moving parts there, but uh, you know it, it all uh, works to get you uh, closer to what your uh, budgetary objectives were, as I understood them. Thanks, Jim. And so, um, as Jim provided the overview of the non-tax revenues of seventeen million five hundred fifty-nine thousand two seventy-seven, and allocating the fund balance of three million seventy-eight dollars, um, that would have the total tax requirements of one hundred six million two hundred ninety-two thousand. That would, um, at the 98%, 98.1 collection rate on the $3.693 billion, uh, would fund the budget. So uh, the mill rate would that would be recommended is um, 29.52, which is a increase of six tenths of one mill. It's it is an increase. Um, we believe that it's that would be um, acceptable um, to the citizens as well as the RTM, and um, at this estimate at this point in time, for the average household, not for maybe not the average household, for but for an assessment of approximately two hundred fifty thousand, uh, it would equate to about one hundred fifty dollar increase in taxes. So it's a, it's, it's not a, it's it's it is an increase, but we feel that it's, uh, it's important to fund the projects that we've and the operating budget that we've described. Um, at this point, I think we'll recess and. Uh, wait for the various um, resolutions that are required for us to recommend this budget to the RTM. Thank you. Okay, we're going to review and discuss and vote on final resolutions. So, the result of our deliberations and, and most recent votes. Are recommending a budget of 120,773,315 and as I recapped a few minutes ago, net to be raised from taxation of $106,292,038, resulting in a mill rate of 29.52 at a collection rate of 98.1. So with that, I will read the resolutions. First one is resolved that the Board of Finance recommends the European appropriation of $60,303,541 to the Board of Ed 
Board of Education operating in capital for fiscal 21 22. Moved by Victor. Second. Second. Discussion. I'll read that resolution over again because I didn't have my mic on. So. <laughs> Resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of sixty million three hundred three five forty one to the Board of Education operating and capital account for the fiscal twenty one twenty two. I'll move that resolution. Moved by Victor. Second. Second by Bob. Is there a discussion? All in favor? Aye. All right. Thank you. Next is resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of sixty million four hundred sixty nine thousand seven seventy four for all other town departments for the fiscal 21-22. I'll move it. I'll second it. Moved by Bob, seconded by Jeff. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Resolved that the Board of Ed, I'm sorry, resolved that the Board of Finance hereby pass the following budget for the fiscal year 2021-22. Board of Education operating, $60,005,541. Board of Ed Special Ed, zero. Board of Education Capital and Leases, $298,000. For a subtotal, Board of Ed, $60,303,541. Town Department, $60,469,774. For a total of $120,773,315. I'll move it, Joe. Moved by Jeff. Second. Second. Seconded by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of $61,646 to the Open Space Fund budget for 2122. I'll move that. Moved by Victor. I'll second it. Seconded by Bob. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Next is resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of 14926 to the Sewer Assessment Fund budget for fiscal 21-22. Um, moved by Charlie. Second. Seconded by Harry. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you. Resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of 76600 to the Board of Ed Shoreline Adult Education Enrichment Fund budget for the fiscal 21-22. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. Yes, Seconded by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of 485766 to the Board of Ed School Age Child Care Fund budget for the fiscal 21-22. I'll move on. Moved by Charlie. Second. Second by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. It resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of $4,574,073 to the wastewater treatment plant budget for the fiscal 21-22. I'll move it. Moved by Harry. Second. Seconded by Victor. Is there a discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is the resolve that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of three hundred eighty-eight thousand five forty-seven, the annual control fund budget for fiscal twenty-one twenty-two. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. Second. Second by Victor. Is there a discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Next is resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of $1,691,214 to the Human Services Special Revenue Fund budget for fiscal 21-22. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. I'll second it. Seconded by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Next is resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM an appropriation of $369,000 to the lease fund budget for fiscal 21-22. Count moving. Moved by Charlie. Second. Second by Victor. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. 
Next is resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM that with the exception of the first selectman who was elected to take a 0% increase, salaries for the following elected officials increase by 2% for each of their two-year term of office. Second selectman, third selectman, treasurer, Board of Assessment, appeals, RTM moderator and finance clerk. I'll move it. Moved by Bob. Second. Second by Victor. Is there a discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Thank you. Next is resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM that salaries for the following elected officials increase by 2% for each of their two year term of office town clerk and tax collector. I'll move it. Moved by. Harry. Harry, thank you. Second. Second by Victor. Is there a discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay, that concludes our uh, required resolutions and recommendation to the RTM. I would Joe. like to thank Joe. the... Actually, I just thank you. Uh, Ray has that there. Yeah, I think. yeah, if you can just amend the uh, first resolution with the elected officials, I think it's the RTM moderator and RTM clerk, right? Yeah. Yeah. RTM clerk. So we left the RTM clerk off? Yes. And is there any substitute, anything comes off? No, no, I think it's just for that resolution. There's no... Uh, no, I think it was accounted for, right? Yes. Yeah, it's all. It's all yeah. yeah, it's all. It's all. It's accounted for in the book. It's just for your resolution here. Okay. So the. So we have a resolution. So this resolution that I will read will be substituted. Will substitute for the prior resolution. So the. Resolved that the Board of Finance recommends to the RTM, with the exception of the first selectman who was elected to take 0% increase, salaries for the following elected officials increase by 2% for each of their two year term. And that includes second selectman, third selectman, treasurer, Board of Assessment Appeals, RTM moderator, RTM clerk, and finance clerk. So we added RTM clerk. Yep. Would somebody like to move that? Yeah. Moved by Robert. Second. Seconded by Victor. <laughs> Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Okay. I think we're done on resolutions. So I would just like to thank the board and all of the department heads, in particular uh, the finance department, Mr. Finch, Jim Finch, and Catherine, and uh, for their good help on this. Also Lisa for the good work as clerk and the good support and guidance from First Selectman Jamie Cosgrove. Um, thank you all for participating. This was a tough year. It's a little cumbersome with the, with the type of media. And also, uh, just so that everybody knows, we, did, we do spend a lot of time in the budget. We have seen these budgets year after year, so sometimes we may not spend as much time on them, but we look at each budget and know it well. Uh, we also felt that, in fact, while this is a year for modest tax increases, we feel that the expenditures and capital items and operating expenses were appropriate and keep the town in the good fashion that, that it is. Um, with that, if there's any comments by other board members, I'd welcome them at this point. Thank you, with none. Jamie, you have any words of wisdom for us? Sure, Joe. Thank you, and thank you to the board for your uh, deliberations and, and recommendations. As you mentioned, uh, Joe, this has been a challenging year uh, throughout the year. Uh, we've, you know, heard in these meetings as others, and uh, just whoever you talk to, right? It's unprecedented times, challenging times, extraordinary times. Um, and you know, when drafting this budget, certainly uh, we recognize what we face, but I think we. We've met the challenges as we have in the past when developing a budget. Uh, we hold a strategy that has served this town well. We look to maintain a high level of service. We fund our future liabilities. Um, 
and uh, all while being sensitive to the taxpayers. So I thank everybody involved in, in the department heads, uh, the, the finance department, you know, Jim and Catherine, uh, the tremendous work that they do uh, throughout the year and really uh, overseeing the finances and the board of finance. So thank you and I look forward to continuing that strategy as we go through the RTM process. Thank you, Jamie. Okay, with no other uh, work for, to come before the board, I'll ex motion entertain a motion to adjourn. I'll second it. Made and seconded. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Thank you. This program was brought to you in part through the support of the Town of Brantford. Watch town meetings and other videos on demand at BrantfordTV.org.